10th Enniskilling Fusiliers, Derry Volunteers, in action March 10th and 11th, 1916. O oh, brave lads of Derry, it makes our hearts merry to hear of your deeds on a foreign French soil. On the battlefield, glory redounds to your glory, though far from your homes on the banks of the foil. The bloodthirsty Germans, the vilest of vermin, bombarded your lines, but alas for their toil, like noble defenders, you cried, no surrender, the glorious old watchword you learnt by the foil. Some people traduced you when duty induced you to answer your king and your country's call. You have shown the wild hun you can handle a gun, brave lads from the ban, the row and the foil. Your officers too showed true grit through and through, captains, lieutenants and NCOs all. You're sure to be in for the march on Berlin, then hurrah from the tenth from the banks of the foil. While brave deeds we are singing, a sad note is ringing for your comrades that parted from all earthly toil. They have fought their last fight, they have died for the right. God comfort their friends who mourn by the foil. Just a day, another day Beneath the Belgian sun Past grave on grave, row upon row Until I see the name John Condon Carved in stone with harp and crown Little crosses in the ground And standing there My silent prayer Is for a boy Who died a soldier We lad Who'll not grow old Heroes That don't come home Here they lie in Belgian fields and Picardy Just a recruit in soldier's boots From Ireland's shores to here This living hell, this polka pell Where young men fell like you John Conn All around the harp and crown, little crosses in the ground. Stand up in proof, the bitter truth, the waste of youth that lies forgotten. We lad will not grow old, hero. Don't come home Here they lie In Belgian fields And Picardy Now tell me John Before I go on What did you come here for With Ireland's bow your life untold, 14 years old, to die a soldier. And all around, the harp and crown, the crosses in the ground, what cause was served? So undeserved. Heroes that don't come home Sing out for all their soul Here they lie in 
Belgian fields and Picardy. Here they lie in Belgian fields and Picardy. And then I was called up into Campbell College for medical, and then. Call back again, you know, then, as all the other years were, you know, yes. to Campbell College. And we were there all day, and you get, they give you tests to do and that. And at night time then, they took us to the boat, to Hesham. Oh. So we were all shepherded onto the boat then, <clears throat> to Hesham. And then when you were killed out and that then, of course, you went, uh, well, they called it square bashing. You had him, do marching for about six weeks. Then they had a passing out parade. And after that then they asked you what trade did you want to go on to? So uh, a few other girls and I opted for uh, Cook. So then they sent us to Wheaton and Blackpool for six weeks training. And uh, for my trade test I, I had to make a rice pudding. But I passed for flame colours. <laughs> so then we were posted then, I was posted then to RAF Dunbrook and Lincolnshire, Bomber Command. And I was there uh, four years. And while I was there, I was promoted to uh, an LACW. That is an equivalent to a Lance Corporal in the Army. Yes. When we were at the hot plate serving up, there was a wee flight sergeant we had and he used to stand behind us to see if we were giving away extra, you see. And he used to sing all these wee Scottish songs <laughs> and he used to say to me, Right Paddy, you can give us the, 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 the London Air Air now, <laughs> you know. <laughs> the crack was good, wasn't oh, indeed, it, you know. Indeed. You know, we were here, the aircraft going out there at night when we were mm -hmm. going out on raids. They would have been away by, <clears throat> by 11 o'clock and then you would have heard them coming in in the morning time about 4 o'clock. You know, you had to have bacon and eggs and all ready for them coming in. And uh, if they all come back safe now, I have a photograph of uh, the bom a bomber there in the hall and they would have circled Lincoln Cathedral. That's only if they all came back. Yes. They would have circled that cathedral mm -hmm. and said a prayer before mm -hmm. they come into land. Some of the aircraft coming back and then they all shot up, you know, it was terrible.